is one of the few automakers that seems to have openly embraced the complete electrification of its lineup, planning to implement this even before the European Union imposed deadline of 2035. Its first bespoke EV, built from the ground up to be electric, is an SUV called the Volvo EX90. Mechanically it is virtually identical to the Polestar 3, riding on the same platform, with the same pair of synchronous permanent magnet motors, the same 111 kilowatt hour battery pack and basically the same specs. However, that's really where the similarities end, because the EX90 is a lot more conventional looking than the Polestar 3 and it's designed to be a more practical vehicle, featuring a third row of seats where a six-footer can just about fit. Its exterior looks like an evolution of the XC90's design, but with no grille and slightly longer front and rear overhangs to improve aerodynamics. Inside, a minimalist interior design puts most of the EX90's controls on a large touchscreen infotainment system. The look is clean and classically Scandinavian, but it may be irksome to drivers who prefer physical buttons and switches on their dashboards. The interior feels open and airy, thanks to a large glass roof and there's room for seven riders, thanks to a standard third row of seats. Leather upholstery has been banished from the options sheet in the interest of eco-friendliness, but the materials used instead look high-end, especially the available wool fabric that's blended with plastic recovered from recycled bottles. Onboard is a 111 kilowatt hour battery pack that Volvo says should deliver around 300 miles per charge. DC fast charging capability is standard and is said to need as little as 30 minutes to juice the battery from 10 to 80%. The EV architecture used in the EX90 also allows for bi-directional charging, which means you can hook it up to your house to power appliances during a power outage, or use it to charge another Volvo EV if needed. Thanks for watching.